Good evening, Bibbits. Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's Sunday the 6th, I think, and I need to get rid of this thing here. I don't know why I welded it on in the first place, but it's got to go so that I can get rid of these really annoying bits of wood. Uh, and if the wind's going to stay very low, I may attach it to one of the smaller gears. But first, I have to get the drive shaft off. You can see here the screw that's come loose. Where's it going? There. That's that lot off. Just for a size comparison, this is my old plasma cutter. And on the left is my new one. So you can see it is definitely chunkier. This is the chain off the uh, turbine as it was running. And we've got this bit as well. And two bits here, so that's good. Might be needing to buy any of that for a while. It's a little bit rusty, we'll need to slap some WD-40 equivalent on it. That's the batteries on the rack. Looking good, not wired up yet. But ready to be beaten. Also got some two meter long booster cables and some of these clips to make my own battery connectors. So before I hit it with a plasma cutter, I'm just gonna clean it up all the way around. No, plasma car required. So we got rid of the most of the crud. You right, Cody? Good boy. Not sure how this is going to work out, but we'll soon find out. I'm going to go with 35, I don't want to go with 40, that might be pushing it a bit with the plug, so 35 amps it is, using the internal air compressor. Alright, let's go. I'm afraid it's back to old-fashioned grinding. It's not really going to do the biz on that. The plasma cut up and just ending up with too much of a mess. What a mess. It's got through some of it, but I'm going to have to use a grinder. Oh! And it's off! Yay! Dang it, at least it's gone. At least it's gone. Lovely brand new flat disc, that'll clean it up in no time. Won't quite come off because it starts getting stuck on the rust here. So I'm going to probably have to take that off. Up on it, east! We don't want to get it stuck on. Hey. Sweet. Let's take this other one off for good luck. There you go, that's all three bearings off. So now we can give this a good clean up. So that's a job well done. <clears throat> and we can, what I want to do is I want to give it a good clean with a grinder and then hit it with some metal polish so hopefully it won't go rusty. Will this be strong enough, this bit now? I'm not sure. 
might be best uh, trying to do something with that. I don't want to weld it too much because it'll just bend completely out of shape and it's it's not bad at the minute although it has a little bit of a bend at the end. So anyway. That'll do for now. I need to go and rest. But the next video will be this getting put back together. Sweet. Oh, and I'm just gonna put some polish on it before I uh, call it a day, because that way hopefully those bits won't rust. Sweet.